Hi guys and welcome back. Today we are going to design emergency button and start a new part and start a new sketch on a front plane. Then we will use one circle that will be 19 millimeters and we'll use extrude both base and it will be 40. Click OK. Then we'll sketch on this surface and we'll make again one circle that will be 27 and again use extrude both base 2 millimeters and click OK. I will add some fillets here. They will be 0.5 and click OK. Next thing that I'm going to do is to sketch on this surface here and uh, here I will add one circle that has to be 15 and it will be 10 millimeters and we'll click OK. I'll add now some colors and some material. This tree has to be chrome and uh, this will be plastic green is okay or we can change the color for here I want some color like this one click OK and uh, then we'll continue to sketch on this surface. Now we need two circles. This one will be 14.5 and this will be 13. Then I will add two lanes here. So one here and uh, the other one on this side and I will create two center lines. I will make these two lines symmetric and they has to be six millimeters. Connect this line to origin point or start it from the origin point. I miss it. And this point will be coincident to this circle. Then select these two and this line here and make mirror. Next thing that we have to do is to use trim command, trim these lines, this here, and use circle that has to be connected to this or, or coradial and go in extruded cut we'll use this here to extrude our sketch and we will use 16 millimeters click OK that's great again sketch on this surface and make one half cir circle And another one from here or use command convert entities we use these two lines convert entities we can use central line again coincident and again vertical select this and make mirror use extrude both other side 60 millimeters, not merge, and make this here to be a glass, and it will be this kind of glass. Other thing that we have to do is to sketch on this surface, we will make two lines.
So two lines, one central line that going through the point, origin point, make this three symmetric, add one dimension here. This has to be 5.9 millimeters and we will make one circle that will be 10 millimeters and drag these points to this circle. Use trim entities and trim this. Go in extrude both base one millimeter. Uncheck this box and click OK. Next thing that we are going to do is a sketch on this surface. Make two rectangles. One central line that will be coincident to this point. Make these three lines to be symmetric. These four lines equal. And this here point two. Also add these two to be equal. And uh, we will add a dimension one here. That's going to be 6.7 and this here will be 3.5 millimeters we'll make this point and this point vertical and also we'll add a relation for this here also vertical and I will use extruded cut two millimeters and I will click OK maybe I will change this point 2 and I will make it point 5 and I will click exit sketch and OK The next thing that I want to do is to sketch a few more things. Also, I will sketch on this surface and I will make also two rectangles. One here, one here and one on this side. This center point will be vertical with this and this center point will be vertical with this. I will make one central line here that will be vertical and I will add relation between those three lines and they will be symmetric. Also I will add one central line on this part here and again I will make this three lines symmetric. I will add here one dimension point two. Also I will add one dimension here point two and I will make this here to be 2.3 millimeters. This here 2.3 millimeters and I will add one dimension from here to here 4.5 millimeters. Also, I will make same thing for this here 2.3 millimeters, 0.2, and from here to here 4.5 millimeters. So, I will go in future extrude cut and I will use this here, this this, this, this and this I will use one millimeter and I will click OK I will start new sketch on top plane and I will draw 
one rectangle here. On this rectangle, I need one arc. I will add one dimension here that will be 6 mm. This will be R1 and this dimension has to be maximal. So again 6 mm. Use one central line. Make these two tangential. Also these two. And use linear sketch pattern. Other side. Three millimeters. And use three parts. I will add this point and this line coincident and I will add one dimension here to here 3.2 millimeters. Other thing that I need is one slot that will start from here will end here and this will be 0.5 This dimension is one millimeter. I will also select this this slot and I will use linear other side three three point two and click OK. Okay. I will use extrude both base two directions one point, point 0.5 on one side and point 0.5 on the other side and click OK. This will have other color and other material. It has to be brass and use this Next thing that we are going to do is to sketch on this plane here. We will make one circle and extrude both base. It will be 15 millimeters. And also, I didn't add a dimension for our circle. It has to be 22. Exit the sketch. It will be also from the other thing that we will do is uh, to sketch on the right plane. I will create one line that will start from here and will continue on this side. Then we will have one. arc I will add few dimension from here to here we will need 3.7 from here to this point we need 14.2 and we will add one dimension here 0.3 This has to be R1.5, but we need one more thing here. This will be 0 0.6, and we will make it coincident to here. Also, We'll add one dimension here, 11.5, and we'll trim this here, and we'll use Revolved Bose Base. For axis of revolution, use this line, 
and click OK. I will make this thing to be plastic low glows and red. Now I will start a new sketch. First I will change this red color. I, I want it to be more like this. So I will start a new sketch on this surface and I will make one central line that will be 2 millimeters and I will make one central line here that the center of this central line has to be coincident with this line coincident then add some letters and make them to start from here click OK I'm hoping that I will manage them to come in the center of the circle and yes they are they're okay now now I will create one circle that has to be 21 and I will make one another and I will add one dimension here one millimeter I will add one line here and I will create a few lines here. Make these two lines collinear. millimeters and equal this has to be 16 four point two. create one central line here symmetric and also it will be symmetric between these two points one more line on this side that oops that will be also 4.2 and use trim also trim these things here and select this thing make a circular sketch pattern three times equal and click OK go in future extrude cut point two click OK And here is our emergency button. We can change color for these things and we can make it yellow and click OK. So here is our emergency button. Thanks for watching. If you like this video, click subscribe and uh, see you in our next video. Bye-bye.